Hello, welcome to another episode of Tony's Cast Customs. Today we have a showcasing and a mail call of some recent finds that my daughter and wife picked up for me. And a package from Steve from Miniature Mustangs, everyone. And also a letter that I pre-opened. I'll share that right now. It says, Tony, thanks for supporting my channel and keep up the great videos. Charlie from Big... Charlie's Model Garage, everyone. Isn't this awesome? Yeah, here it is, everyone. It's a straight out awesome, man. Really appreciate this, Big C. Yep. I'm gonna put it right here, brother. I'll fix it up better. Really appreciate that again. Now let's get to the recent finds. My wife and daughter picked this up for me. I think they went to Target or Walmart. I think it was Walmart actually. Because they told me the prices of the main line has gone up to 108 now. Just for one main line. So I told them, yeah, I don't pick up any main lines because they might pick up ones I already have or I don't need. So they finally found a, because I haven't found this yet. They found a Hot Wheels exposed engine set. Yeah, here it is, everyone. Yeah, with that. Gas Monkey Garage Corvette, that Bone Shaker, and that Rigor Mortar in the bottom, and that Hot Rod, then that Chevy Gasser on top too. Yeah, definitely nice vehicles in this 5-pack. I'm still trying to find the Night Burners, and also the, the new pack of the, it's like the one with the Mustangs I believe, it's just all like, they're all Mustangs, I am still haven't found that yet either, so I need to look for that too. And they picked me up these Maestro collections. I guess they're dropping some new ones. I'm not sure if they're new, but yeah, I, I mean, I told them I like bare layers and anything that's purple and trucks, especially silver autos. So they, they kind of listened to me what I get. And they actually shocked me with this bare layer. Yeah, here it is, everyone. It's uh, with the Ram truck, a 1957. Chevy Bel Air man gasser. Yeah, definitely sweet man. It says Nachos Auto Parts. Yeah. And this ramp truck is nice too. Yep. Definitely a sweet fine. The next one is because they told me because it had purple. It's the nineteen sixty five Buick Riviera with the camper trailer for my Oslo designs. Yeah, definitely beautiful. That purple with white with that blue stripe in the middle. Yeah, I think it's just straight fire, man. And then this one, I was actually shocked they found. It was a 1997 Chevy 1500 with the classic craft, you know, the classic, you know, your classic trailer in the back. Definitely fire, man. I'm not sure if these were newer ones or older ones, but man, I, I haven't seen these or like in any were Walmart, Target. So yeah, I was kind of shocked that they picked these up for me. I was like, man, I only only picked up the Ford Mustang one and the GT40. So yeah, but yeah, they, they picked up some good finds without me. I was kind of shocked. So now let's get with to Steve's package. I kind of know what's inside. It was kind of like a surprise. I didn't like see the whole thing yet, so I'm gonna open it in front of everyone. Yeah, it's still. Yeah, you see, miniature Mustangs is in the house. <laughs> Steve, everyone. Okay, being safe with your razor blade, hobby knives. Remember that. Always cut away from you and just be safe, everyone. Closing it, cleaning this little cubby. Oh no, he did it, man. Steve, brother, you did not have to do this, bro. Um, I see some fire, but there's a letter. Let's get to the letter first, everyone, before 
I might have a heart attack. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's get to the letter first. It's in this beautiful Ziploc bag. The bunch of, you know, I think it's stickers also. You know, show it everyone right now. Oh, there's a. We'll start off with the letter and then we'll get to everything with the stickers. It says Tony encloses the golf Batmobile. I do each one differently. So yours is unique. Also included some other cars that I hope you and your son will enjoy. Thanks for your positive contributions to the diecast community. Your brother Steve. Oh, this is just awesome, brother. I really appreciate this, bro. Yeah, big time. And I believe this is his car, you guys. Look at this Mustang. Isn't it just straight fire? Yeah, definitely. Well, let's get to the stickers. And he... Oh, he gave me a little keychain. Oh, here's that Batmobile, man. The Batman. The Golf. Definitely fire, man. This whole package. I have a feeling it's always going to be... Anybody's package is fire, but man... Brother, you went all out, bro. Look at this Firebird, you guys. Man, straight fire, bro. Look at this gasser, man, with the orange crate decals. An official YouTube sticker. Nice. This is from Steve from Andrew Mustangs. Everyone, I'm going to be dropping his channel in the bottom, so please check him out. A miniature Mustang sticker, everyone. Awesome. And... Who doesn't love Hot Wheels? Man, look at these stickers, man. Yeah, this will probably go to my son. And I really appreciate this. Yeah, some of these. And look, he dropped me a little yeah, razor blade safe one too. Definitely. These are always good to have. Oh, another sticker. Awesome, brother. Oh, he even has a little pin. Nice. Yeah, this is awesome, bro. It's a little... Yeah, look at this, you guys. This little, it's a little, this push, you know, push pin clip thing. Yeah, I haven't seen these in a while. Yeah, I used to collect uh, Volkswagens of these. This is fire, bro. To have one from you now, miniature Mustangs, definitely. Look at this keychain from him. This page and his, isn't this straight fire? Yup. Definitely. It has a sticker of his vehicle on the back. Definitely fire. All right, let's get to the box. Gonna be safe putting all this stuff away. All right, first I see Oh, no, you didn't, brother, man. He put a treasure hunt in here, you guys. A 69 Corvette, man. With purple delivery and racing. Look at this. Man. Brother. This is straight fire, brother, man. This is beautiful. I honestly don't even have this Corvette in. Man. Oh wow, <laughs> it says to put out the fire. <laughs> awesome, Steve, yeah, this is straight fire, brother. A chrome fire eater. Yeah, definitely fire, man, look at that, you guys. All chrome, straight fire, man. Oh, nice. Here's this beautiful, you guys. It's the 65. Impala Lowrider, man. I don't know if you guys noticed, but Hot Wheels is coming back with these ones. But they're called the Lane Lowrider, and the there's a little engine right here on top. So, yeah. And you move with the tires. And they're basically based on this, you know, casting on this Impala Lowrider. So, they just changed it to Lane Lowrider. So, yep. Definitely a beautiful casting, bro. I really appreciate this. My son is currently playing video games. Yeah, he loves Friday nights. So yeah. 
Oh, this is beautiful, bro. It's from the Steel Flame series. Man. It's purple, you guys. Look at this truck. Man, I'm feeling that window with this truck and those flames. Definitely fire with that purple, man. Look at that, you guys. Straight fire, man. Anything with purple, believe it or not, you guys, with fantasy castings or anything. I just love purple, man. This is just beautiful, man. Thank you, Steve. Oh, no, he didn't give me a, a purple passion. Man, I used to collect these a lot, you guys. <laughs> man, purple passions in the house. Look at that, stunning with those white walls. Man, it's, it's just, isn't it just beautiful? Man, look at that. Definitely. Purple passion, definitely. Yep. Oh, nice. There's another stunning 97 Corvette with Hot Wheels racing delivery. Look at that, you guys, with the blue American colors. Red, white, and blue. Team USA. Definitely beautiful, man. Definitely. Oh. Straight fire right here, man. Nice. A Corvette Grand Sport Roadster with this yellow delivery. Also another racing theme. And I actually missed out on getting this Corvette, you guys. Yeah, this one was kind of hard for me getting here. So I'm kind of shocked to actually have one now. So, yep. Thank you, Steve, again, man. I think I'm going to be saying thank you too much, brother. But, man. Man, you sent fire, bro. Like so many people do, man. Oh, wow. Is this what I think it is? Yep. It's one of the 2001 first editions of the Monte Somo. The Monte Soma, actually. Yep. Here's the first editions of the Monte Soma. Isn't this just beautiful, you guys? Has that California like lowrider look. Definitely. Yup. This is just straight fire, man. Yeah, that yellow. Definitely has that California look. Oh, nice. We have a Monte Carlo with the, you know, those high rakers. <laughs> this is straight. This is awesome, bro. Man, I re we, me and my son appreciate this big time, but man, I, I mean, right now I'm appreciating it more because I've seen everything, but he might see this afterwards. But man, this is, this is straight fire, man. Look at that Monte Carlo, you guys. Man. This is beautiful. It's like Zamac with those racing decals. Definitely beautiful, man. Oh, nice. Is this what I think it is? Yeah, I think it, yeah, it is a, is it a Mercury. It's the, no, it's a 49. Yeah, it is a Merc. Yep, it's a 49 drag Merc. Yeah, look at that, you guys. Definitely beautiful. A Mercury, man. Definitely beautiful. It says 49er. Um, shout out to Wade. You know, he likes the 49ers. Uh, and Big A from Adrian, you know, Big A's diecast also loves the 49ers. Uh, this is still beautiful, but if they could take that 49ers off, <laughs> no, but I'll just take it for the car. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it's still beautiful, though. Oh, nice, brother. You honestly didn't have to do this, bro. He put the a three window thirty forty guys, a Ford, and this is beautiful pinstripe, you know, purple man, a three window, you know, thirty four series model Ford. Man, isn't that just beautiful? Purple again, everyone. Purple passion, purple power, man, right here. 
shoot, straight, it's purplicious. <laughs> and it's just beautiful, brother. Well, there's a some other castings still. Man, this box is straight fire with all these Corvettes too, bro. A Corvette Grand Sport Roadster, everyone, from a Dan and Al series. Uh, look at that. Uh, that's just beautiful, bro. Uh, I love those like racing Corvettes, everyone. Definitely, they're just you know stunning to look at them. Oh, we have a Corvette C6. R oh, man. Man, look at this yellow, you guys. Man. And with the Corvette logo on the window. Man, straight fire, man. Man, look at the, the decals on the side. And that window. I'm feeling that wind on that spoiler in the back. Man, definitely beautiful, brother. This is in the first edition. Oh, 2006. I didn't. I, I missed this one then. Yeah, that's definitely beautiful, brother. Oh, we got a 1998 first edition, the Callaway C7. Everyone, look at this, you guys, with that Zamac style. Definitely another stunning Corvette, man. In the house, straight fire, man. Yep, straight fire, man. Look at that front of that. Hey, yeah, look at that front details, man. Man, definitely fire. And that spoiler, too. Yeah, definitely. And I'm feeling that Zamac look. Well, there's a five pack in here. I'll share with that right now, too. And last, I'm going to be the custom. Oh, it's a 50th anniversary. Hot Wheels, Hot Trucks. Look at this, you guys. And, brother, you didn't have to do this, man. And he put this has some stunning trucks, man. I like that green one in the bottom, too. I think my son will enjoy that one. But I also like the one on the top. All of them, even this Sandblaster one. Yep. Straight fire, man. Even that Chevy right here in the middle. Then that Ford. I believe the top one is a... Yeah, it's a Caddy up Volkswagen. But yeah, that Chevy and Ford is stunning too right there, you guys. And then that Silverado on the bottom. Uh, definitely. Yeah, they're definitely beautiful castings, man. All, all five of these trucks, actually. Uh, thank you, big time, brother. Let's get to that custom, everyone. Um, let's use our little lower the camera and let me open it. Oh, it's so beautiful, bro. It's in a nice little case, everyone. But I'm going to open it just so we can see it better. This will probably be the only time I'm going to open it and see it. Let me just take this a little bit closer. Lower this a little bit more. Uh, isn't that just stunning, you guys? It's definitely unique, brother. All those decals, those wheels, the brakes on the the rotors, you guys. Let me lower a little bit more to give that better zoom in action. Yeah, there it is with the light. You guys can see better now. Definitely, you know, get some highly details with those brakes. That paint job, those decals. It's straight. It's beautiful, bro. I love Batman. But yeah, this this is a straight fire, bro. Golf delivery. And with Batman, it's just a perfect combination. Definitely. I like the details inside also, brother. 
Nah, it's just beautiful, bro. Like the orange inside, everything. The little things are painted inside too. Yeah, the cluster, everything, man. It looks so cool. I really appreciate this, Steve, man. And this is probably gonna be the only time I'm opening it because I'm not in, taking that screw off, brother. You know, eventually I've been thinking of carrying all this up here, you guys, and just putting, you know, diecast community sisters and brothers, you know, customs or yeah, exactly, just starting to display more of those, man. Because you know, everyone needs to be sharing each other's customs, and in my opinion, it's just straight beautiful work, brother. And I really appreciate this once again, Steve. And you guys remember to check out his channel out. It's gonna drop his channel link once again. It's gonna be below in the descriptions. And and if you guys want to get to it faster, I'm just gonna. This whole episode is gonna be out to him too. And check out you know Big Charlie's Model Garage also. So thanks everyone for watching. You know I always appreciate the comments and always much love to everyone. And have a wonderful weekend, everyone, and be safe. And have a have a great day and night, and peace, everyone.